All right, my friends. It is finally time. This poor little race drone has been sitting parked on the pegboard right there. With the batteries in storage for, oh, about a year and a half. It's been a long, long time. So, this is going to be a test to see if I can revive all of these batteries. Got a lot of batteries. To see if they even have any more life left in them. I put them all in storage mode. Or storage discharge, if you will, before I stored them. And they should all be in good shape. But we will find out. So I'm kind of anxious and eager to do this. And look forward to reporting back about what I discover after long-term storage. These bad boys, 5,200 milliamp hours are for that big sucker right there. So we're not going to worry about those. But the rest of these, yep, got the sky zones in here. Still in great shape. And uh, the Emax 250. As well as, hopefully what's in here is my awesome Tyrannus radio. Cool. Oh yeah. Here's that big old sucker for that too. So, got a lot of work ahead of me. I can't hardly even remember how this thing works. How you're supposed to charge things. So, it's like learning all over again. But uh, hopefully everything works out well. More to follow soon. Now, if I'm remembering how to do this correctly, so far it looks like viewing all the cells is still right at 3.7. So that's pretty sweet. Let's disconnect it real quick, see what happens. Be super careful with the balance board. I already roasted this once by accidentally putting a 3S one pin over on a 4S and put hot and it sucked. So yeah. Another 3.73. I think that sounds pretty reasonable. I'll bet all of them are in good shape, so we shall find out. Alright, so they all checked out uh, as having held a charge at about 3.73. Got these two 1300 milliamps set up. This thing held my memory. So that's uh, added together 2600 milliamps, 2.6 amps. Try to bring it up to 4.2 volts. Everything should be connected. Let's give it a shot. Oh yeah, you gotta hold down the start button as I recall. It asks, everything checks out. And start. Boom. Let's look at the units. That's cool. See how much it's put back in there. Unit 3.78 graph. It's gonna be cool. Looking forward to flying this thing again. Been a long time. All right, success. It looks like 54, 52 minutes, and it pumped 2,007 milliamps back into it. Back into the two of them. Back up to 420. And pretty sweet. And one last check on the four pack. Ran for 57 minutes, put 5,786 milliamps back in there. It's working just like it did when I put it away. And hopefully, the dang aircraft flies just the way it did when I put it away.